Should be. Hello, I'm Marin, and this is Moments with Marin. I am welcoming Leah on, and she is our groundskeeper and facility manager, or property manager. Property manager is what property. we decided on, yes. That is right. <laughs> property manager! Hi! So this, she is the lovely face that's around campus taking care of all the projects and such around here. So we just wanted to give a shout out to her on Moments with Marin and introduce her. So welcome. Thank you. Yeah. I'm happy to be here. Yeah. Or for you to be here. <laughs> <laughs> so let's take a look around campus. Perfect. All Sounds right. great. If you're ever out here, you can sometimes find me here at the workshop. Otherwise, I'm running around usually. <laughs> All right. Let's take a tour. Perfect. All right, and so tell us a little bit about yourself. Like, how did you hear about the open door? How did you become like facilities property manager? Sorry, and how did you, yeah, how did you meet the Bakis and everything like that? The well, we um, we heard about uh, open door actually from Guy Mayhew. Uh, oh. He uh, just was telling about how much he loved it here and. Um, how great the church family was and uh, we decided to come I would say three and a half years ago probably when we were still at the North 40 building mm -hmm. and we were searching for something new and my kids absolutely fell in love with it the first time that we went and so did we and so we started coming then and then that fall mm -hmm. of when we started coming is when we moved out here mm -hmm. and uh, yeah it's it's a beautiful space and then I would say probably two years ago I was approached by a couple out here that said hey you look like you could paint how would you like to paint the lakeside cabin and I said sure so then I just uh, would come out here I think it took me about seven days and I would come out early in the morning when the sun would rise and it would just be me and I'd have music on and I painted and overlooking the beautiful lake and listening mm -hmm. to the loons and mm -hmm. um, it was it was awesome and then I just became friends uh, with Asta and Kirsten and just we started hanging out more and um, yeah and we were we I worked on projects with um, Kirsten and her husband Sherman out here and then when it came time that they were kind of looking for someone mm -hmm. uh, they just said hey maybe Lee would love to do that and I'm like <laughs> yes I would because we worked on the beach getting all the the sand the grass out of the sand and we worked on trimming trees together and uh, it's been a great fit I absolutely love it and I used to spend a lot of time out here also just walking through the woods I don't know if you guys know but there's actually lots of trails and I plan to cut more trails walking trails Ooh. through the woods in the in the future Fun. Um, but there's actually trails that go all the way we have a campground on the one end past my workshop and there's trails that go up through the woods and they actually go all the way around campus um, up by the crosses and come back down by hillside and come all the way back down here. And it's just a great place to um, find peace, worship God, mm -hmm. pray. You can. There's tons of spots you can just sit and clear your mind and feel like you're getting close to God. There's a lot of animals out here. Cool. Um, it's great. I'm loving it. Yeah. So, yeah. Should we take a look? Yes. Let's look. Let's show them. All right. <laughs> come to know the Lord well I would like to say I was raised on hot dish and Jesus <laughs> because I don't ever remember a time where Jesus wasn't a part of my life mm -hmm. uh, I accepted Jesus or asked him to come live in my heart when I was in kindergarten mm -hmm. and I don't know it was just Jesus has always been a part of our family and our family's life and we were always very active in our church and uh, with 
the church family that we had. Yeah. Um, and so, I don't know, I just loved it. And I had, we had a very active youth group when I was growing up. And so um, I was just on fire for the Lord <laughs> during those years too. And um, yeah, and now I'm getting to instill that into my own children. Yeah. So it's, it's awesome. I love it. So I don't know a time in my life that I didn't know Jesus, I would say. Yeah. So, oh, sweet. Yeah, awesome. great. Pa- I have great parents, so yeah, they <laughs> they loved me well and loved Jesus well. So, oh, awesome. yeah, and you're doing the same now with your kids. I'm trying. You're doing great. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you are. And so that's it. That's all I got today. We're all gonna right. Continue to just go wander on the trails so you guys can get some more views. But that was the property, pretty much. Yes, little, little bits. And come on out and visit. And uh, I'd also love. I've been having signups in the back. Yes. Of church the last three Sundays. And as you can see, this was only just a small snippet of <laughs> how big the property is. Uh, and there's lots of buildings. And so if you have time and talent uh, and tools to come out here and help me out, uh, that would be great. You can call the office or you can give me a call and sign up to come help at different times because we have lots of grounds work and also maintenance on the building. So I'd love to joy- have you come join me and uh, work alongside each other and take care of our beautiful church family property. Thanks for all you do. Thank you.